This is barely enough for my mom's medicine. How much jewelry do I have to sell? I like this bracelet. It's called Starry Night. I designed it myself. These are all Grammy designs. How dare you plagiarize it? No, th this is my work. Filthy human. <gasps> you got some nerve setting up your stall. Werewolf to <laughs> Alpha Liam, the board is waiting for you. You're courting death. Sees all of this. It's stolen. No, no, please. I, I need to raise money for my mom's surgery. <laughs> What's Rachel doing over there? Seems that she has a problem with the vendor. Liam! Thank God you're here. This bitch just tried to claw me. What are you doing, bitch? Stop calling me that. Just because you're a werewolf doesn't mean you can treat me this way. Liam, are you proposing to me? Marry me. What? I don't even know you. I have to go, you werewolves are crazy. Hold on a second. I need to show you something. Who are you? What do you want? Look, first of all, call me Liam. I know this is a lot. It's a lot to explain right now, but just do this for me. Marry me. I'm sure about this. Mate, she's our mate. We finally found her, after years of searching. But I don't even know you. Besides, I don't want anything to do with werewolves. Jeez, is she gonna reject us? I'm not a werewolf. I'm not a werewolf. I'm a regular guy. That woman out there, I, I, I have nothing to do with her. She's crazy. Look, I don't know what game you're playing, but I don't even want to be in a relationship, okay? I have to raise money for my mom's surgery. All right, you help me out with this. You trust me here and do this for me. I'll pay for your mother's surgery. Huh? How about that? Why do you have to marry me? Like I said, this is a lot right now to explain, and I'm going to explain it. But just do this for me. What are you doing? Why is Miss Lake so upset? <laughs> Mr. Lake's so happy to have just gotten married. <laughs> See, hey, you're smiling. You look really cute when you smile. I'm sorry I've been in such a mood. Honestly, this is the happiest I've been in months. Thank you. You don't need to thank me. I'm your husband now. I'm always gonna try to make you feel happy. So what's next? Why don't we go to my pack? What? No, I can't take her to the pack. She thinks I'm a human. Why don't we go to my house? Where do you live? Right over there. The Rose Garden? That's a nice place. Andrew, buy me the Rose Garden hat. You coming? Yeah, I'm coming. I've bought the neighborhood. What? 
you told me you wanted it, right? Right, yeah. I'll uh, take care of this, boss. I'll hold down the fort. Pardon? Don't call me Alpha right now. Pretend to be my boss, all right? Sure. Okay, Alpha. <clears throat> yes. Uh, starting today, you will be in charge of this project. Yes, sir. I'll, I'll take care of it. Wow. Your boss seems like a tough cookie. It's a difficult job? Yes. Come on, let's go inside. Grab some drinks. Wow. You live in quite the swanky place. I'm impressed. Yeah, it's just a rental. But, uh, you know, I'm sure we could find another way to heat things up. <laughs> I like the way you think. But do you really live here? Why do you act like you don't even know your own home? But do you really live here? Why do you act like you don't even know your own home? Who needs a coffee maker? I was thinking now that we're married, I could help you make money. What do you think? That's yeah, a very tempting offer. I've actually been thinking of a way to make this place feel a little bit more like a home. And I was thinking that I move in. Okay, I'll be right there. Where are you going? My trinket stall. I have a customer. Seems like my mate is working hard at her career. Andrew, from here on out, the responsibilities of the pack are gonna fall on your shoulders. What do you mean, Alpha? Well, Dora's my mate. She hates werewolves, so I need to keep my true identity under wraps so that I can pursue her. Do you mean the lady from yesterday? How can she be Silver Snow's Luna? I mean, she's just a human. She's the gift that the Moon Goddess sent me. Just don't talk about her like that, all right? My apologies, Alpha Liam. You tell my father that I'm gonna move into the apartment tomorrow. Alpha Liam, what about Rachel? Sir James shows her to as a match. I got no interest in Rachel. Okay. I found my true love. Won't you be attending tonight's banquet? The alphas of other packs will be there. No. I've got some jewelry to sell. How's it going? How did you know I was here? I'm smart. These your designs? Yep. I made these knickknacks all by myself. They're beautiful. Thank you. But I know you're just flattering me. Except for Vivian's friend, I haven't had any shoppers. Andrew, call someone over quick. What are you doing? Nothing. Whoa, this is so beautiful. How much? It's late. I'll give you a discount. 30? OK. 
kind of expensive. It suits you very well. Let me help you try it on. See, I told you. Gorgeous. Okay, I'll buy it. $30, not 30000 How is this amazing artwork just 30 bucks? It should be 30 grand. And this ring should be worth 50 grand. I can't believe this. I've never made so much in one go. I told you that your designs are beautiful. You deserve this, Dark. <laughs> How am I going to get home? It's alright. It's alright. I'm here. No, I wasn't kidding about what I'm saying. You can stay here if you want. Thank you. But I better sleep on the sofa. I, I'm not used to living with a guy. No, why would I let you sleep on the couch? But I can't. No buts. You're so nice to me. Thank you for tonight. I want you to have this. It's the first design I ever made at the Lawrence Institute of Art. Lawrence Institute of Art, huh? It's a top art school. What are you doing now? Why do I live off a stand? Yeah. I dropped out. My junior year, I entered a design contest. Someone stole my designs and snagged first place. I had a meeting with the dean, and he kicked me out. Do you know who the copycat is? No. Only that she's some werewolf hotshot. She smeared my name, saying I was the one who stole her designs. Well, I'll save this pendant for when it's worth a lot of money one day. When you hit it big. But, you know, I hate to say it. It's not really a long-term fix to live off of a stall. Have you ever thought about getting a job at a design company? Sure, I'd love to. But no one really wants to hire me given my diploma. That's my pizza. I'll be right back. Andrew, let Dora work at Rami. Are you sure, Papa? Sir James has already signed Rachel as design director. What if she finds out that Dora is your wife? I believe in you. You seem like you're in a good mood. The woman we met at the stall, she reached out to me and said she's a design director for Rami. She wants me to come in for an interview. <laughs> <laughs> I've been so lucky ever since I met you. Are you my good luck charm? Mom, I'm with Liam now, and I've landed an interview at Rami. Things are looking up. Fingers crossed for your recovery. What are you doing? I'm sorry for getting all mushy. I just miss my mom. Dora, I have a friend in the hospital who 
gonna make sure that your mom has the best doctor for her surgery. She's gonna recover, okay? Liam, you're the best, thank you. That's just husband duties 101, right? <laughs> I'll pray that you kill that interview. I'll figure it out. It's your turn. It's her. Hm. What's wrong with the HR department? I didn't realize they were letting mere high school graduates infiltrate our business. I'm sorry. It's true, I only have a high school diploma. But I studied at the Lawrence Institute of Art and oh. I- Oh, so you studied there, but you failed to obtain a degree? Somehow even worse. Please, um, these are my designs. I, I create and design my own jewelry and I even have my own small business. What do you think Grammy is? This isn't some arts and crafts playtime. Take your garbage and get out of here. I told you. Hey, your designs are beautiful. You know, you may think you're the greatest designer ever, but you're vile, and you have no right to judge my designs. 